Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608, and today I am playing Star Maid. And we are still working on, um, what is this thing? The toaster carrier, the, the fighter carrier. And just adding a couple more lights there. Just not sure why, but I just felt like those needed lights. Not done with the nose plate, so that's probably not a good... Uh, Turn it off, then back on again. Let's look at them blink first, make sure they blink. Those are blinking, oh no, because they are out of render distance. I should probably crank that up. Have I cranked it up? I don't know. Huh. That's a good question. Anyway, uh, looks like we have lights in the front, and let's see. Let's hit X. X takes us back to center-ish. And let's hit here. Make sure symmetry. There we go. Symmetry is good. Let's see if we can clean this up a bit. Not something like that. No, 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 no. How long is this? Longer than 84. I know that. Longer than 113, it's not as long as 151. 120? Longer than 120. 130. Close enough. So let's, uh, let's actually do like a wedge here. Wedge, and by wedge I definitely mean slab. Why? Because it sort of gives us sort of more encapsulation, and you don't see the full light block, so... I don't know if that gives a cooler appearance or what. Let's see if I like that better. Yes, I think I like that better. For whatever reason, it looks more inset. Huh. <laughs> the logic's straining to, to render all these lights over this distance. Hmm. All right, so let's... Uh, that's why I had to have repeaters when I made the uh, battleship. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and make some big design decisions today. Because this is our spaceship, and we need to make these big decisions. I'm going to rip all this nonsense out. Would you put that nonsense in? Yes, yes, I did. But that is part of the Star Made experience. Undoing the things you've done after you realize, I didn't really want to do that. Hmm. Right, so now let's... Um, Let's take this, and we're just going to experiment a bit. What if we did a number like this? There we go. Come on, there you go. Good boy. All right. And... Four. Take that up to five. So originally I was thinking a big like a big hepta here. I don't think I want a hepta anymore. I want this. Now, as I say this, as I'm gonna regret doing this because all the wedging. But just to see how that would look. Oops. And then, then up to here to here. We had a, like a cutoff right here. Okay. I can dig it. Just going to do an outline here. Can you dig it? And is that a hepta? There we go. Oh, look, Triforces. <laughs> All right. Except, oh, 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 let's do something better. Better than Triforces? Well, I don't know how much better than Triforces it is, but let's wall in this and wall in these. There we go. And that too. Now let's grab uh, some dark gray, dark gray standard. There we go. And have like a inset panel of wedges. Yeah, I think I like that. At least I like that in theory. 
I don't know what happened to that hefty. Yes, I do. It fell in the crack, but that's fine. We'll live. Unless we don't, then, then we won't worry about it. Oh, I like that. That little panel there. Let's see, and do I want to, like, uh, do something here? Like, those are, like, welding joints or something. Hmm. Okay, I like that design. Then here... I'll have to design something a little different. Because it's inset. And this needs like a curve or something. By curve, I mean a uh, angle. Can I, will like 45 come and hit this right? That's my big question. Oh, oh, oh. 45 hits close enough. All right. So we can do a 45 at... Let's see here. Undo the bar. Bring that in a bit. Out oh, just one more. There we go. Spin her around. Sound like a line dance. Spin it around. All right. Let's say flat bottom ship. I believe those make the rocking world go round. I'm just going to put these here for good measure. Probably not going to even need these. In fact, they're probably going to be removed or hidden or something. But just try and get this connected because I need to connect this to this. I'm not entirely sure how we're going about it. Or if, even if we are going about it. Properly is probably a better way to say. Let's see. And make that a little thicker there. All right. Just want to encapsulate this. There we go. Oh, I kind of wish that... Uh, Starman had like a, a a thing I could like plug my brain in and and just say like brain build it and I'll say yes sir, just kind of translate what I'm thinking to Starman. That's not mm, tall enough. How tall is tall enough? Not that. More. More. That more? That's more enough. All right. So let's do this. See if see how we like this. It's getting corners filled in. That's what we're doing right now. Just filling in corners. Happy little corners. <laughs> All right. Let's get our happy little corners. There we go. And let's not have you be a corner. All right. Oh, that leaves this here. And let's just spin that right round. That is not the way I spun you. There we go. Well, it is the way I spun you, but it's not the way I wanted you to be spun. All right. There. It was a really thick lip there, but hmm, I'll live. Let's rip that out and put a... Oops. There. I like that better. Okay. We're getting there. We're blocking things in. Now, how do I want to deal with this? Well, I do have this natural corner piece here. So do I want to do something with it? Or what? Let's see. Hmm. So I could take that and just come in like that. But how will this... This edge, how will that handle it? Huh. What if I did a wedge like here? Oh no, then that has that weird shape there that doesn't kind of... 
Doesn't really fit with anything. Hmm. That's a problem with witching. It doesn't always do what you want it to. That's sad. Alright, come on. There. Actually, let's keep it there. And then from here... Ah, this is, this is how we do it. I... There we go. We'll just follow... Follow the lines we already have, duh. And that does not need to do that. That needs to do come this. There we go. Except not this. It needs to become the other way around. There. So now it matches that hip to have a lovely little corner there. Then we're gonna do a similar operation down here. Oops. Let's see. And that oh, I spun it around. There we go. I think part of Star Meat, or at least witching and hulling and whatnot, is learning to see these shapes. And sometimes they're hard for me to see. See how the, the pieces are supposed to interact or interact naturally. I I think that's one of the good, th or the things that separates a good builder from a, well, from me, is the uh, ability to kind of see the shape they want beforehand and and work with them before they actually get them i'm not a tremendous builder so that's the wrong button oh it's the right button it's the wrong block there we go just building these little wedges happy little wedges you don't want unhappy wedges in your life Happy wage, happy life, or something like that. That might not be the way this saying goes. It's close enough, though. All right. Now, what am I going to do about this nonsense? Well, I could just bring this in. Ah! See, and this is where I talk about seeing the... I don't see it. So let's get this... This spurred away. Come on, there you go. Hmm. Why do I just want like a square shape here? I don't know. And do and oops. Like that? I don't know. I honestly don't know what I'm doing. And I'm fairly sure that's all kind of obvious that I have no idea what I'm actually doing. Now, can I follow this in to. Is that going to look weird? That's going to look weird, isn't it? Let's see, what if we just block it off? There we go. Well, let's do some dark gray here then. Just breaks things up just a little. And this is not a very important part of the ship. It's just this little connector here. So, just little details. All right. I think that is acceptable. Doesn't look too bad. All right. And let's go ahead and do something like this here. Normally, I don't like to pull on camera. As I've said before, as I've been pulling on camera. But, I have been. It's probably been helping me become a better builder. Not exactly sure how, but I'm, I'm fairly sure it's been helping me become a better builder. It's because now I'm talking through my process. I don't know. You should try it. Build a <laughs> wedging on camera. Trying to talk and think at the same time. 
Most people don't even talk and think at the same time when they're not on camera. All right, so let's see. Let's just get this little corner here done. And we will call it a day. Let's see. There we go. Oh, a day, is it night for a day or a day for a night? Uh, the goofy cartoon. May have been a night for a day. Day for a night. I don't know. It was a goofy cartoon that I enjoyed as a youngster. Night for a day, I think. Ah, anyway. Let's see. And, and the cartoon had the character Goofy. Well, I guess it was a Goofy cartoon, but uh, I mean that the character was Goofy. Yeah, anyway. Let's just use this. I don't know what I'm, where I'm going with this. Goofy has thrown me off. And not built here. This is blocked. It's a blocked by. Am I blocked by that? Oh. Guess it's saying it's too close to that. All right, block it then. Uh, why am I so deep in here? Well, dummy, you can't use any of this. This needs to be covered. Uh, here I am talking about Goofy, and I'm demonstrating that I am indeed Goofy. Hmm. All right, rip all this out. I have been JW608. This has been StarMate. We're going to figure that out at some point. Probably figure out engines at another point. And I think we're done. Or, no, no, we need to decorate the big empty room that was supposed to be a logic room, but I ended up doing the logic in stuck to a reactor somewhere. So we will figure all this out as time goes by. And I'll see you then.